Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today's topic is going to be related to Viagra. So what we are going to do, we're going to see how um, Viagra, which is um, also widely called uh, sildenafil, is related to the endocrine system. So um, just a little background on the endocrine system. The endocrine system does consist of the pituitary gland, which is also called the hypophyses, which hangs from the base of the hypothalamus. So um, the base of the hypothalamus does end in a stalk, which is also called the infundibulum, uh, from which hangs the pituitary gland, or as we said, the hypophyses. So the endocrine system also does include the pineal gland, the thyroid gland, thymus, pancreas, adrenal glands, and ovaries and testes. I hope I didn't miss out anything, but these are the major organs. Um, now let's get into the second messenger system related to Viagra and how this system works. So sildenafil, uh, which is the oral phosphodiesterase PDE inhibitor and is considered the first line therapy for men with erectile dysfunction. The mechanism of action is uh, sexual stimulation, which uh, results in smooth muscle relaxation of the corpus cavernosum, which increases the flow of blood in that particular area. The mediator of this response is um, nitric oxide, which does activate guanoline cyclase, forming cyclic guanosine monophosphate, which is also known as cyclic GMP from guanosine triphosphate. So cyclic GMP produces smooth muscle relaxation. I um, already went over that uh, through a reduction of intracellular calcium concentration. So the entire nucleotide cyclic mechanism is controlled by the action of PDE, um, which is also known as the phosphodiesterase inhibitors. Uh, specifically, uh, the PDE5 is, uh, um, is the important isozyme responsible for degradation of the cyclic GMP um, in, the, in the corpus carvinosum. So the action of PDE5 inhibitor is to increase the flow of blood into the, um, into the corpus carvinosum. So I mentioned that before, so um, it is very important to note that PDE5 inhibitors are metabolized by cytochrome 453A4, um, which is also known as CYP3A enzyme, which is um, an enzyme system in the liver. So that's not the only enzyme, there's many others, but this is the major one. So um, additionally note that the action of these drugs is to inhibit PDE5 and the adverse effect is to cause color disturbance or the loss of blue or green color uh, discrimination by inhibiting another enzyme called PDE6 which is specifically found in the retina and it is very important um, in um, color vision. So thank you for watching my video. I hope this was helpful. If you have any more questions, please leave a comment in the description box um, in the just in the description box below. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and um, share this video with your friends. Thank you.